Hey, happy Wednesday. How y'all doing? This one goes out to all my perfectionists out there. All of you that hold yourself to such high standards that no one on this planet can ever reach. Yeah, I'm very, very, very familiar with that. But you know, I picked up a new hobby. It's not necessarily a brand new hobby. It's something I've been interested in for a long time, photography. When I was younger, you know, I've had cameras and all that kind of stuff, but I never really learned the nuances, the basics of photography. And back when I was younger, there wasn't all of the resources that we have nowadays with people that are very passionate and are very willing to freely give out advice and teach others and stuff and things like that. So I've been taking it slow. I've been enjoying the learning process, learning different things, learning about the camera, learning about the lenses, all that kind of jazz. But also at this point in my life, I'm a little bit more mature. I'm a little bit more patient and I've come through a lot of mental health type stuff and I've learned to accept that perfectionism in some cases can be a good thing. It can lead you to really keep pushing forward and growth and stuff, but in a lot of cases it can be a bad thing because there's a lot of hobbies that I've dropped because I just wasn't good enough at them in a, in a quick enough time. So now I'm giving myself patience. I'm giving myself time. I'm not rushing myself. I'm accepting that I'm not gonna be the greatest at it. I'm accepting all those things because I know this is one thing where my creativity does have an outlet where my vision, the things I see or how I see them, I can actually express them when it comes to photography. So it's something that's really gonna, gonna do good things for me, for my mental health, for my emotional health, for, you know, just everything in general, you know, going out there and just engaging and doing street photography and stuff and portraits and stuff of different people that I see out there and stuff. It's gonna be something that I really needed in my life. And, you know, some advice to my, my best friend had given me that I need to find a hobby back when I was going through my stuff, but I talked about it before, I didn't know up from down. And then dealing with perfectionist tendencies, you know, you pick up that hobby, you ain't good enough, you're gonna throw it away and, you know, you waste all this money, you know, neurodivergence, you know this. So, you know, it was something I really needed to take some time to really figure out what really touches my heart, what really touches my mind, makes my my blood run and actually gives me the motivation, like I said, to not hold myself to too high of moronic standards. So I hope you can find something like that. I hope you can find that patience. I hope you can give yourself a break, give yourself a chance to pick up on new things, pick up on new hobbies and stuff. Don't expect yourself to be perfect. Give yourself grace. Give yourself the same grace and mercy and understanding you would anyone else out there and enjoy your life and do fun things that are gonna fuel you. And trust me, you're gonna be better off for it. So anyways, have an awesome Wednesday. You're an awesome, amazing human being and I love you so much. You can really tell. Peace out, bye.